These odd-shaped, bronze-colored rocks, backed by Mount Whitney and other majestic snow-covered peaks, have provided a spectacular setting for countless tales of Hollywood's Old West, as well as such far-flung locations as India, China, Afghanistan, and occasionally, even other planets. This sleepy community in California's high desert country lured movie companies because it offered a rugged, romantic mountain setting within a reasonable driving distance of Hollywood. Directors and cinematographers loved filming in the Alabama hills just west of town, where the distinctive rocks extended far into the distance, offering a perfect way to display motion and distance. The snow-covered white granite Sierra Nevada in the background filled the frame and contrasted perfectly with the darker Alabama hills. From the beginning, many Lone Pine residents worked for the movie companies and support industries, some of them as stuntmen and extras. Initially, rancher Al Gallagher furnished the horses and cattle that filmmakers needed, but it was local rancher Russ Spanhauer who built a business around supplying the movie people with whatever they needed for filming. Horses, cattle, wagons, stagecoaches, and other items. He also signed up local residents and cowboys to work on and in the pictures. Eventually, Spanauer built a Spanish mission set and later added a western town and street set on his Anchor Ranch, a sprawling spread just south of town along Highway 395. By most accounts, the first movie filmed in the Lone Pine area was The Roundup, a Paramount picture starring silent screen comedian Fatty Arbuckle which began filming in early September of 1919. Then the Hollywood Cowboys came, and for nearly 40 years they continued coming, shooting their sagebrush sagas by the dozens, 